Hi everyone, welcome back. In this session, I will discussing about data sufficiency. This is the last session in data sufficiency. Let's go for first question in this session. See here, in which year, in which year was Sanjay born? In which year was Sanjay born? We need to find the year. We need to find the year in which Sanjay was born. That is the question he is asking. Now first, uh, first option is only one and two. By using first one, by using first one, what is the information? Sanjay is six years older than Gopal. Sanjay is six years older than Gopal. So Sanjay is equal to Gopal plus uh, six. It means if you know Gopal year, definitely it is very easy to get a Sanjay birthday year, right? And next, uh, by using first one, you will not get the answer. Now you can go for second one. If you go for second one, Gopal's brother, Gopal's brother was born in 1982. Gopal's brother was born in 1982. We don't know about Gopal. And we don't know about what is the difference between uh, Gopal brother and Gopal, right? So, you cannot say exactly the answer by using uh, 1 and 2. You will not get the answer. Sanjay date of birth. And next, uh, coming to 2 and 3. 2 is this one. And coming to third one. Sanjay brother, Sanjay's brother is 2 years younger than, 2 years younger than, Gopal's brother, two years younger than Gopal's uh, brother. Sorry, uh, Sanjay's brother is two years younger. Two years younger in the sense uh, minus uh, Gopal's brother. As comparing with Gopal's brother, Sanjay's brother is uh, two years younger. Two years younger. And the information, this who represents uh, Gopal's brother? Gopal's brother was eight years uh, Eight years younger than Gopal. Gopal's brother. Gopal's brother. Eight years younger. Eight years younger than Gopal. It means the gap between uh, Gopal and Gopal's brother that is eight years. So from uh, third one, this is the information. From second one, this is the information. Now if you combine the two and three. If you combine two and three. Here, Gopal's brother 1982. If Gopal's brother 1982, as Gopal is uh, uh, eight, Gopal's brother 8 years younger than Gopal, obviously you will get uh, this particular person Gopal. This particular person Gopal. So, Gopal's date of birth is 1982. 1982 minus 8, 8 years before. Why? Because uh, Gopal is 8 years uh, older or else Gopal's brother 8 years younger than uh, Gopal. So, you need to subtract 8 from this so that you will get uh, 1974. 1974. 1974. This is Gopal date of birth. Gopal date of birth is 1974. And uh, if you combine 2 and 3, you will get Gopal date of birth. But you will not get uh, Sanjay date of birth, right? So, this is also eliminated. Now, 1 and 3. If you use 1 and 3, here this value, Gopal brother value doesn't know. If you don't know about Gopal brother, it is not possible to get Gopal. So, by using 1 and 3 also, you will not get the answer. Now, you will get the answer by combining all 1 and 2, 3. Why? Because the reason is if Gopal data birth is 1974, 1974 and uh, according to first statement, Sanjay is 6 years older. Sanjay is 6 years older than Gopal. It means uh, obviously Sanjay is born uh, 6 years before. It means that uh, 1974 minus 6, which is equal to how much it is? 1974. 1974 minus 6. 1974 minus 6, which is equal to 1968. 1968, uh, this, is, uh, uh, this is the date of birth of Sanjay. Sanjay was born 
on born in 1968 and sanjay is 6 years older than gopal so gopal date of birth 1974 and uh, there is a difference of 8 years between gopal brother and gopal so gopal brother date of birth is given that is 1982 it satisfies all conditions uh, here initially sanjay was born after that gopal was born after that gopal brother was born here sanjay was born in 1974 and gopal was born in sorry sanjay was born in 1968 1968 and uh, gopal was born in 1974 gopal brother was born in uh, 1982 right see here this is the answer you are getting the answer by combining all the statements 1 2 3 option d is the right answer next one last question in this uh, data sufficiency topic uh, what is suman's rank from top what is suman's rank from top in a class of 40 students in a class of 40 students total 40 students are there in the class uh, we need to find uh, suman rank we need to find uh, suman rank right now the first one is uh, only one and two you can take only one and two and also here uh, we have uh, only two and three and also only two and uh, either one or three only two and either one or three now we will check it out with uh, each and every combination we will check it out with each and every combination first of all uh, let us take first one suman is three ranks below deepak from top when we are counting from top when we are counting from top uh, suman is three ranks below deepak let us take deepak is at this position we don't know the position of deepak uh, but uh, suman is three ranks uh, below deepak this is suman right but we don't know uh, deepak is which position if you know the position of deepak whether it is from top and uh, top uh, top or else from bottom then we can directly set the answer so by using only one it is not possible now you can combine one and two deepak rank from bottom 23 from bottom if you take from bottom deepak rank 23 so above that 17 members should be there why because uh, total 40 members in a class uh, out of 40 members 23 is from bottom so above that uh, 17 members should be there now if you count from top uh, deepak is 18th position deepak is 18th position so obviously suman is uh, 21st position from top uh, suman is 21st position from top this is from top and uh, this is from bottom we want uh, the position of the rank of uh, suman rank of suman from top uh, so the required answer is 21 you you are getting the answer by combining 1 and 2 you are getting the answer by combining 1 and 2 uh, but don't directly keep the answer as 1 uh, and 2 why because here there is an option called uh, only 2 and also either 1 or 3 it means 2 uh, and 1 or else 2 and 3 two is the common uh, statement two is the common statement uh, and you can use either first one or else you can use either third one right now two is a common thing that is uh, deepak rank uh, 23rd from bottom deepak 23rd from bottom and uh, above that obviously 17 members should be there 17 members now you can use third one suman ranks 3 uh, ranks uh, above deepak suman ranks 3 uh, ranks above deepak right above deepak 3 ranks see here above deepak 3 ranks in the sense 1 2 and 3 so obviously this position here this is 23rd position from top uh, from bottom and this is 18th position from top this is from top and this is uh, 17 16 and this is 15 so you will get the answer you will get the answer now by using first one by using one and two by using one and two uh, suman ranks 
three ranks below. Suman is three ranks below Deepak from top. From top, Suman is three ranks below. Whereas coming to this case, Suman is three ranks above Deepak from bottom. From bottom onwards, Suman ranks three ranks above. Three ranks above in the sense that is this one. From bottom onwards, three ranks above. And next, uh, from bottom onwards above and uh, from top onwards that is uh, below. From top below, it means this side, from bottom three ranks uh, above. That is this one. Uh, this is 23, three ranks above, like this. Uh, so, here you will get the position of uh, Suman. You will get the position of Suman uh, by taking uh, uh, 1 and 2 as well as uh, 1, uh, 2 and uh, 3. By using this one and also by using this one, you will get the answer. So, option E is the required answer. Only 2 and either 1 or 3. Only 2 and either 1 or 3. Option E is the right answer. Here, you will get the answer by combining 1 and 2 as well as by combining uh, 2 and uh, 3. So, option E is the required answer. Thank you guys. I hope you enjoyed the session.